Ladies and gentlemen, when you think of WWE, you think of John Cena. Loved by many, resented by some, but respected by all. The following champion vs. champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from West Millbury, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 251 pounds. The WWE Champion, the greatest of all time, John Cena! He has won Royal Rumbles, Elimination Chambers, Money in the Bank matches, and the most WWE title reigns. He's also won the hearts and minds of the WWE Universe. Yeah, as fickle as the audience can be at times, they know true greatness when they see it. We are witnessing greatness. down come on high wow one of the very best to ever do it Shawn Michaels career defined by memorable and historic victories. A back-to-back -back Royal Rumble winner, the first ever Grand Slam champion, competed in the first ever ladder match. I hate to cut you off, Michael, but HBK's accolades could go on all night. He's a true inspiration, a shining light in this business. WrestleMania taking on big match John Cena. Big fight feel in the building for this one, guys. Yeah, Cole, each man individually always brings that big match feeling to the arena, but facing off against each other here, that's like lightning in a bottle. You, you mean a light bulb, Corey. I'm gonna ignore you entirely, Saxton, because not even you can take away from the magic we are about to see. He got whipped into that corner. Target acquired and destroyed. Had Michael scouted there. Oh, there's the crucifix. Nicely done. And a shoulder in the air. He's not. No way. Suicide dive. 
soaring out of the ring, looking to do as much damage as possible. Look at this matchup here, Corey. What do you think John Cena needs to do to find a way to win? I think Cena just needs to do what he does best, react to the moment. John has an unparalleled natural intuition when it comes to entering action. He can read an opponent and see where they're headed, which should help him find openings for big time attacks. Countered it just in time. He's burying elbows in the midsection. And gets tossed back into the mat. has to show his resilience after taking that maneuver. And that's just scratching the surface of what Cena's capable of. Dominating shoulder tackle. Getting carried around a bad spot to be in. Check your face after that one. He heads outside. Countouts legal in this match. Tough position to be caught in here. Right across the larynx. Looking for a scoop slam. No, it slips behind. Inverted DDT connects. Michael's got it all with the flat. Does he get him here? Got it. No, just a two. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. Here comes the home Mr. WrestleMania. Cena stays. Cena powers him up. Attitude adjustment. Will that keep Michaels grounded? And a kick out. No one saw that coming. You can never count the heartbreak kid out, guys. Michaels refuses to concede this fight. And now Cena can't waste any time. That wasn't the outcome he expected, but he has to remain the aggressor. Some showboating from Sean here. Cena's out of it. John's in peril here. Swing chair music out of nowhere. HBK got all of it. There's two. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner, the Heartbreak King, Shawn Michaels. I don't know what more of these two could have thrown at each other, but HBK is the one walking away with a win over John Cena. They left everything in the ring tonight, and I still don't know if this thing's settled, Cole. Hey, you might be right, Corey, but right now, Michaels is in celebration mode, and the party is just starting for HBK.
Let's start off this match in a civilized manner, guys. Oh, handshake, uh, good sportsmanship. I guess I'll... Oh! oh what was that you said about civility, Cole? I saw humiliation and disrespect, and I love it. Well, guys, you know, they should have known better than to take the bait. And one of these two superstars ended up looking like a fool, and we are just getting started. Tensions are high. Emotions running high in this highly anticipated match, but this is officially underway. Respect is earned, not just handed out. There's no reason to expect it right out of the gate. Maybe this match ends with a change of heart, maybe it doesn't. But you can't just expect things to be all sunshine and rainbows heading into a competitive matchup. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Great wherewithal on the counter. Launching himself from the ropes. As their opponent hooked a couple of jab, placed it over into a suplex. And it had to have taken maximum effort to lift their opponent like that. Careful and measured fist drop to the face. Dax gets countered. Setting up for something here. Piercing the throat. And targeting the leg there. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Big forearm. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Uh-oh. Well-placed elbow to the leg. Headbutt to the gut! Really just laying it in. Incoming. Oh, targeting the stomach. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. He's able to fend off the attack. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Exhibiting it. Will this be enough? And he gets the shoulder up before two. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Spot. Explosive assault from Devon. Devon continues to maintain the advantage. Goodness gracious. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. Headbutt to the gut! Uh-oh. And he's out of there in a nick of time. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. <laughs> oh, what a right! Look at this. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. And will the strain that it took to deliver that backbreaker be worth it? Enough already. And he tosses him back in now. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. You can't take much more of this. This has just been an absolute... Look out! Oh, just completely off target there. Good God, just a disgusting thud hurt here at ringside. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Dominating shoulder tackle. Vicious right forearm. Oh! To the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. And he very quickly counters. <laughs> Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Picture perfect takedown. Oh, right across the solar plexus. These two trading one blow after another. 
Big shots being fired right now. Neither competitor letting up. Bam! It looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Moved at the right time. Ooh, forearm connects. Does he have him here? He got the shoulder up in time. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. Big forearm. Short jab to the rib cage. Those are agonizing. Single underhook suplex. Nice. Ooh, walloped by a huge club. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Oh, Stacks fights back. Big right hand connects. Incoming. Drive by. Evans now being sized up. Kick connects with a body. They drop bang. Is it the finishing touch Stacks needs? Cover. is your winner. Here is your winner, Kenny Stacks Lorenzo! If this win doesn't earn them respect, I don't know what will. You have to consider this win a point made. This is a demand for respect. Who knows if they've earned it from their opponent with this win, but they've certainly earned it from the WWE Universe. Get ready for some higher learning. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing Chase University from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the Saxon, why don't you go try out as a cheerleader for Chase U? I did already. They said no. School jokes aside, this is a seriously competitive team. No doubt, Corey, and they're always focused on improving. Here comes Gigi Dolan. A truly confident and passionate competitor. And from Atlanta, Georgia, Gigi Dolan. She came up the hard way and has constantly faced adversity. Worked hard for everything she has, and she's not going to stop now. And the thing about Gigi is she is tenacious, sometimes even vicious, when she's backed into a corner.
Gigi Dolan has the ability to be pretty imaginative in the ring. She says her creativity is how she expresses herself. That's the bell, and as you can see, Thea Hale is ready to make a statement here tonight. Not the most experienced member of the roster, but she's getting better with each match, with every bit of adversity thrown her way. She's looking to be the next big thing here in WWE. The opportunity to prove herself is hers for the taking. Tonight could be that pivotal moment. And Gigi Dolan looks focused, looks ready to prove herself right here, right now. Toxic intentions in store for Dolan, ready to put her body on the line while all eyes are on her. Escapes and a chop block takes him down. <laughs> Complete control right now. Look out. Oh, what a way to shatter an arm. Oh, to the arm. Terrible. Oh, and she turns it around. Placed in the corner. Kick. And full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Thea gets the better there. Gigi didn't see that coming. Oh my God, a clothesline! Oh my gosh! Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Comes crashing down. Corey, we know how dangerous Gigi Dolan can be on any given night. We do, Cole, but we also know how frustrated she can be when things don't quite go her way. Things could be all roses for Dolan, and then bam, one unforced error, and she's spiraling. If I'm in the ring with Dolan, I'm capitalizing on that error as soon as it happens. Just agonizing pain for their opponent, and enjoying every minute of it. Heads outside, but can she score the pin? Gets the shoulder up. Wow, what's it going to take? It's impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Counter! And now there's an opening! Uh-oh. She had it scouted! From behind! On a German suplex! Oh, strong knee connects. Working the arm and then a kick right to the ribs. Dolan is looking to close this one out. Gigi Dolan, what is she looking for? Oh my, the Gigi driver. That could end Hale right now. Oh, she's still alive. Escaping that pin must have taken almost everything she's got. Well worth it. Look how frustrated her opponent is. A big opportunity falling through their fingers. You've got to continue fighting and hope your next big move is the last one. She saw that one coming. Couple of clotheslines. Well placed kick right to the face. Ah, oh, seated bionic elbow. Talk about dismantling your opponent. of Gigi Dolan on display right now. Look out! Suicide die! Whatever it takes to win. Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. An uh, arm bar. Just stretching out the arm. Whip back into the ring. Saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Quick exchange of counters there. Hale able to ward that off. Shot drop arm breaker. Things not going how she'd like. Not a better. Oh, the Kamara. 
Come on, lock cinched in. Body wrap. This could be over. And look at this. Come on, lock. Nowhere to go. But per oh my God. They broke out of it. Each shot landing with a little bit more venom. Slugging away with everything they've got. Just teeing off with that fight forever vibe. Who will break first? That is the question. Both absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. Oh. Ooh. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. Two fighters putting their haymakers on autopilot right now. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Think about all the pain she's in right now. There's no shame in giving up now. Looks like she has other plans here. I think she was just looking to soften her up a little there. Ooh. Strikes with a kick. Headed to the top rope. Taking flight. Body splash. Looking for the victory. Two. Gigi Dolan has done it. Here is your winner, Gigi Dolan. Thea Hale put away in this one. Dolan has put in the work, and these are the results. Congratulations are in order. The animal has arrived. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C. Weighing in at 290 pounds, he is the world heavyweight champion, the animal. We can list this man's accolades all day long. WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania. And now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. success both in the ring and in Hollywood which is insane because for some reason the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough well no question about it Batista will demand the respect 
of the WWE Universe right here tonight. The WWE Universe just exploded! And his opponents, first from Melbourne, Australia, weighing in at 225 pounds, Buddy Matthews! The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. One of the most prolific competitors in WWE history. Without question, a man who has exhibited over 25 years of dominance in sports entertainment. And that dominance will continue before our very eyes tonight. Throughout his career, he has transformed himself into a household name. That's after results of a career spanning decades of main events and championship reigns. Triple H has inspired so many modern superstars. And he can still go toe-to-toe -to -toe with them. This is a man who has truly mastered every aspect of this business. Yeah, a true genius behind the curtain, almost as much as in the ring. Speaks to his love for this industry, his love of competition. Uh, you mean his love of dominating the competition.
survived some of the harshest training in Japan. When you look at Carl Anderson, you're looking at a man who has a different level of threat. Now, he may like to crack jokes, but when Anderson's back's against the wall, he becomes a focused and extremely dangerous competitor. A textbook definition of a mercenary in WWE will have your back if you have his money. I've seen your paycheck, Saxton. Carl Anderson will never have your back. The feeling is electric in here. It's a big fight feel. One can only imagine what these gladiators have in mind. Corey, what does the champion need to remember? The Fatal 4-Way is literally a colossal matchup. I want to state that for the record, this match is mathematically unfair to the champion. Good point, Corey. The champion does not have to be involved in the decision to lose their title. The champion has a 25% chance of holding on to the title. Those are not great odds, no matter who you are. Up is down, and down is up after a move like that. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Headlock. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, jeez. Take all the wind out of you. Now, this is the kind of match where you can really push the bounds of damage. Maybe not. Not enough yet. Batista avoids impact. Powerless position to be in right now. Ooh, right to the throat. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. He saw that one coming. Uh-oh. He turns it around. Uh-oh, we're not afraid of Tigers. Tiger suplex. Has Carl in his grip. Utilizing the top rope to inflict more punishment. Across the top rope. Anderson's toughness was called into question by that offense. And you can see why Batista carries himself with such confidence. It's a special kind of out. Quickly to cover. Gets his shoulder up before the two count. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. he think he's going? Look, he's just taking the perfect opportunity to regain some composure. Perhaps figure out what to do next here. Had Triple H well scouted. Got him where he wants him. Up oh, and Falcon Arrow suplex. My goodness, the human skeleton shouldn't have to endure a smash like that. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. Seems to be no signs of defense right now. Oh, what a knee lift. Somebody just check his nose. The tried and true method to taking anyone down. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Oh, stomping away. Oh, Charlie. Stunned Buster by Batista. And into the count. but for how much longer? Batista finds the advantage. From behind. Neckbreaker. Uh-oh. Back out the seat. Did you see that? Turned that one around. Set up. This could be a Corey. The Tista bomb. Is it enough? 
He's going for the pin. This could be it. Far off is an elbow. We have seen these men unleash a lot of devastating offense. Incredible that this match hasn't ended yet. It might just be a matter of time. This one is close to coming to a head. Anderson muscles up his opponent. And a fireman's carry cutter. Oh, may have sealed things up. Anderson. Oh, he retaliates. Set up for the incredible oh. sweep. Nicely done. Body slam slipped out. Inverted DDT. Oh, from the rope. He thinks he has it. Running interference. Elbow drop. Piercing. And what a maneuver we just saw there. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, this fatal four-way has certainly taken its toll, Michael. There he goes, right into the corner. Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. Oh, watch out. There's a seat for your face. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. Picture perfect drop kick. Gets the knees up. Incredible wherewithal. And that prevents any offense from Carl. Oh, I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Kick to the midsection. Pump handle applied. Wicked driver. That just waylaid the game. Triple H is still in this one with that kick out. I can't tell him it's Zang. We got a cover. Forces the shoulder up after two. Incredible to think. After every... Anderson picks him up. Trademark execution from the game. And now here's Anderson. This is it. And he stops the count. to the gut. Ragged around into a neck breaker. No! And now Batista expected that one. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. He moves just in time. Listen to this place. And Anderson still shows no signs of slowing down. Batista has to know this match could be slipping away from him. Batista about to get what he wants. And now thrown back. Got him set up. This could be it, Corey. The pitch the bomb. Batista got all of him. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Now Batista. Triple H dodges that one. Make it over. Standing sheer Nui. Eyes are running the a la Harley Race. And a series of vicious stomps. We'll be the end in here. Pins broken up. I can't believe it. Wheels turning. What does the Cerebral Assassin have in store? Triple H has him so Triple H has this all sewn up. Is it enough? The cover! Triple H scores the win. Here is your winner, the game, Triple H! 
An enormous win here in this fatal four-way match. Truly against all odds, managing to squeeze out the victory. Yeah, the other three competitors did not make this easy. We are about to bear witness to the queen. Listen, here is a truly generational talent. There's no doubt about that. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from the Queen City, the Divas Champion, Charlotte. Uh, Corey, I'm sure you would agree that no one makes quite an entrance like Charlotte Flair. I completely agree, Saxon, because every time she's in the ring, it is a spectacle to behold. Charlotte Flair competed in the first women's match to main event WrestleMania and takes pride in always controlling the situation around her. There is no one better in the big moment than Charlotte Flair. As physically dominant as any superstar we have ever seen. Charlotte is always happy to send a message inside the ropes. And each step furthers her legacy. Never been a competitor in the women's division like Bianca Belair. Yeah, yeah, think about this. How do you prepare for a next level athlete like the EST? right here. And from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. An athlete with a track and field background who's already earned multiple weightlifting records at the Performance Center. Yeah, she's already proven she's the fastest and the strongest. And tonight, she's ready to prove that she's the Let's best. Go. Let's go. So many attributes that Bianca Belair has. Power, speed, charisma. I agree with you, Saxton, but the question is, can Bianca put it all together? This woman has asked for an opportunity. She's now getting the opportunity. Now the question is, what does she do with said opportunity? Defense, 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 defense. 
Here we go with one of the hottest young talents on the WWE roster, Bianca Belair. A naturally gifted athlete, Belair has the strength, size, and agility to really be a dominant force in the women's division. She said that things just come easy to her, and she's made it very clear that she won't settle until she's the best. Well, we're about to see if Bianca can back up those claims. Well, she out from the top, through the air. Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A, right there. Don't come over here. Cole, quick, use Saxton as a human shield. Oh, a dead left power slam. That move had the amount of force akin to a natural disaster. Able to get the advantage here. Leg drop. as you can cut it. They're playing with fire here. Corey, what is Bianca Belair's strategy when going into a match against an opponent like her? Belair says she's the EST, but she has to remember she's competing at the highest level. She cannot underestimate her opponent. Belair has to focus more on being the ER tonight. She has to be harder, better, faster, and stronger than her opponent. Hoisted all the way up and down. That powerbomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Places her right in the corner. In the corner. That competitive streak of Bel Air getting challenged there. Uh-oh. Dragon Sleeper applied. This could be it. That's showing the world just how much fight she's got left. for that. Uh-oh. And she finds an answer to Charlotte. Flair retaliating. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Belair with the wherewithal to avoid that. Oh! Kick to the stomach. Hoisted up into a backbreaker. And Looks still like holding on. There's more to come. Another punishing back. She could pin her opponent right here. Stops the count before it, too. She still has enough energy for a simple kick out. Now, ah, trampling the opposition. Oh, man. She might be in some trouble now. Yeah, as the Queen no doubt wanted to put her in her place a little more emphatically that time. Cover! Two count! What a win! Charlotte with the victory! Here is your winner! Charlotte! This has got to be a tough loss for Bianca Belair. It's still early in Belair's career, and I don't think this loss is going to derail her trajectory in the WWE.
The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, The Rock. A man who has been called the most charismatic superstar of all time. Well, the proof is in the millions and millions of The Rock's fans. He's the trailblazing, eyebrow-raising phenomenon. The great one, ready for action. Now, this is one dude with attitude. Big Daddy Cool is in the building. And his opponents first, representing dudes with attitude from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 317 pounds, Big Daddy Cool Diesel! You want to talk superstars on the cusp of greatness? Then look no further than Diesel. The big man's on the come up, no doubt about it. If you're a betting man, you'd be wise to bet it all on Big Daddy Cool. We're talking about seven feet, 300 pounds of pure trouble. Ice in his veins. Diesel's ready to do what he does best, smashing the competition and getting paid to do so. And Diesel is well aware that he's not getting paid by the hour. This could be over in seconds. We are about to see something good. is a superstar who can breathe new life into this crowd. They were already alive, Cole. I don't know how this superstar is going to do anything to change that into being more alive. Yeah, Corey, but the fearless and daring behavior we see from this superstar brings the WWE Universe to an entirely new level. The champ does not want anyone making their name at his expense. He plans on fighting hard tonight. here a triple threat is possibly one of the most challenging matches a superstar can agree to no rules no friends and even if you were friends beforehand a triple threat match makes enemies of everyone it's easy to overthink going into this match but the best way to ensure victory here is to adapt to every moment and that was a hell of a maneuver there guys we're gonna see it Gut power bomb that was one of those power bombs that would shorten someone's career. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. <clears throat> Makes him pay with a counter. Taking it 
to the shoulder. Big time power slam. Corey, what's your best shot at winning in a no disqualification match? You lean into the stipulation and leave no stone unturned. Use everything at your disposal to get the win. Otherwise, what's the point? Oh, and a DDT by The Rock. He's taking some good hits. Yeah, as The Rock was taking the boots to asses mentality to heart there. He's looking for an implement of destruction. Oh, wait, 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 wait! No early kick out. It is going to take a lot more to keep him down. Oh, and then the chest as well. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Planted face first. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Oh, what a clothesline. drop and diesel is countered no telling what's underneath the ring tonight run he's got a candle no stick oh that'll turn your skin red he skirts around it and some effective offense with that one oh man a candle no shot into the cover Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? A truly impressive kick out this late. Turns it around, sole of the foot meets the stomach. Placed into the corner. What's he open to find down there? And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. And that definitely made, and he goes for the pin! Shoulder up before two. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Oh, Byron, how intimidating is this? Well, I don't think he wants any part of the people's champion. Stunning this play of power. The amount of force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. Out, shoulders down. End this now. Oh, he's playing possum. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh. Enough already. Face Buster plants him. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh. He's going to the pin. This could be it. End to the pin. This is not. Uh oh. And it's The Rock with the reversal. Diesel dodges out of that. Dominating shoulder tackle. And back elbow creates separation. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. And now with the kendo stick in hand, he's ready to do some real damage. And he's able to counter. Unlucky spot for The Rock. Last shot on the mark. Can that finish The Rock off? Ow! Into the corner now. Diesel show. Middle rope. Missile drop kick. Hit the target. Able to evade. Here it comes. Right by the people's champ. The Rock got all of it. Uh -oh. Boozled up. This 
is not uh -oh. using the elbow to escape the attack. Oh, the rock and arm wrench right into a DDT. Big forearm. Diesel hoisted him up. This is going to be nasty. Power bomb. Will Diesel seal the deal? Shoulders down. What a kick out at two. The rock somehow got the shoulder up. Yeah, but now comes the hard part. The Rock has to get himself back in this. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that would end most matches. Oh, and a step ahead of The Rock. Well executed hip toss. Nailed it, Shining Wizard. Diesel went down in a heap. Two. He kicks out somehow. He is just barely still in the fight. I don't know how many more times he's going to be able to kick out after that. That was too close for comfort. I've lost count of how many times this match should have ended by now. He foiled that attempt. Just launched. He's running on empty right now. And he has just taken an extraordinary amount of abuse. Dropping the knee for more punishment. And there's got to be concern for The Rock at this point. The Rock is possibly about to be taken out here. And that attack could be devastating for Diesel. Yeah, Diesel has been broken down over the course of this match. Forced the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Double team up. Double neck breaker. The Rock telling him what he said his whole career. Just bring it. Oh, look at the double team here. Uh oh. Double flapjack. Oh, my. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. And he's pulled the ring apron up, looking under there for something. And when he's got that chair, you know he wants to send a serious message. There's the bulldog. Uh-oh. Turning the tables there. Oh, it's right to the cut. And he stops the count. Lucky ends. Ooh. And Diesel reverses it. He returns to the ring. Sweeps the leg for the takedown. Looking to step over to the single leg Boston Crab. Oh no, this he breaks the hold. <laughs> He's got the answer for that one. Pulled in from belly to belly for the win. There's two. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. So, so close. That could have been it. Diesel Dodge is out of there. Equalizer in hand, and he's just goading his opponent to He's going for the pin. This could be it. Fights out at two. Thought he had it. You've got to be kidding me. Quick return to the ring. Had that move from The Rock scouted. Broken up, and the match continues. That's teamwork. The noise surging through this arena is ridiculous. It's the echoes of the universe. Look at this, fighting out with a series of... Will create separation. There is some power behind that punch. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Oh no, come on, don't use a sledgehammer. Think of the children. Targeting the And we just saw some serious offense. He's got the great one measured up. Rock is staggering. Diesel hoisted him up. 
taste victory now. The cover. And he breaks up the count. Look at that insult to injury with that one. Everyone watching this is on pins and needles. What a match. A battle for the ages. You can't help but get amped. Not the position you want to be in right now. Oh, God. Face first. Delicious power slam. from all three superstars in this match. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing. One man out of three. It was always bound to lead to a little chaos. Ladies and gentlemen, the Tribal Chief is here. And we may have no other option but to acknowledge him. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds. The Tribal Chief has faced opponents from every corner of the earth, and none of them have withstood the challenge. And at this rate, who's left? Well, it may seem impossible, but a match like tonight is an ultimate opportunity. Then reality sets in. You are facing greatness on a different level. A record-breaking champion, an unbeatable competitor. And Roman looks more determined than ever. That's why every time Roman competes, it is a history-making moment.
Bray Wyatt has given himself over to the Fiend. One of the most malicious, venomous, bizarre superstars in WWE history. Ask anyone who has had the misfortune of coming into contact with The Fiend. It is an experience that will change your life forever. And certainly not for the better. I know his hands say hurt and heal, but The Fiend seems to focus more on the hurting. Where The Fiend goes, suffering follows. This frightening monster is ready to devour anyone who stands in his way. An eerie supernatural force, and at times seems totally unstoppable. Good luck to his opponent. The Fiend is unlike anyone or anything we've ever seen before. Paranoia and mistrust have really gotten into Roman Reigns' head lately. Makes you wonder just what his mindset will be going into this matchup. Well, the nap time on the island of relevancy. Oh, he's able to find enough grip to fight out of the hole. Crucial escape here. Oh, and Roman fights back. Switches it back around. What power! Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. He's getting a little batter now. Yeah, as Roman came ready to assert his dominance and is doing just that. Ooh! What a counter! into the corner, connecting with a sharp elbow, right in the breadbasket. Stops. A proverbial mud hole has been stopped, and now it's time to walk it dry. And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. Now oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. It has to be hard going into a match against Roman Reigns, knowing that he's favored in almost every match he has. Corey, what do you think his opponent needs to do at least to stifle the confidence of Roman in this one? I don't know if it's possible to cap that confidence, Cole, which is why I think the best bet is to at least attempt to match the confidence of Reigns. If you can hold yourself to that kind of focus and hold on to that confidence, you might have a fighting chance. Boom! He could do it here. I didn't think this match was close to over. Uh-oh. Defiant counter to Reigns. Stiff headbutt. Running senton. And that has to knock all the wind out of you. Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. It was tough. She get airline miles for that. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Stomping. Ouch. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. 
Uh oh, Gorham going to cut off the win. Reigns with the guillotine. I'm not quite. The guillotine locked in. This is all. That was an incredible counter. Lately, things have been a tad heated between these competitors. Yeah, this could develop into a pretty serious rivalry if it keeps escalating. Maybe they'll squash the beef here and now, and that'll be the end of it. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Oh, and there's the cover. And a kick out right away. Better hold up on the victory parade. Uncorked a big punch. He's struggling a bit here. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Absolutely crushing offense from the Fiend. You can see Reigns isn't used to facing off against someone who can maintain this level of confidence. The Tribal Chief is struggling to find an answer to this burst of offense. The Fiend may be thinking high risk. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Oh, gosh, this is uncomfortable to watch. Paralysis is setting in. No, no. The Fiend may have sealed things up. There's two. No, he beats the count. A kick out, and Reigns is still in this. The big Reigns hits it. That's going to keep the Fiend down. executed that it was good night you have to wonder how much more can he take roman has been denied this is not something we're used to seeing and by the looks of things neither is reigns big shot block that'll stop you in your tracks he's taking this to the floor now uh-oh dropping the elbow right on the knee he can't take any more of this. Yeah, this is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Thrown back in under the ropes. What are they going to do here? Their opponent is just... Will it be? Oh, believe me, this superstar realizes how... Oh, oh, come on! on. Second. I understand being frustrated, but that's ridiculous. This superstar just crossed the line. All right, I love this guy.
contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Jeff Harvey. I love someone who has the courage to speak their truth and stand by their words. This person doesn't shy away from anything. Normally, I might agree with you, Corey, but this truth you speak about happens to just be plain mean. Just seems to enjoy tearing others down. No, oh, he's mean. He tears people down. Maybe the truth just isn't for you, Saxton. Here comes a sports entertainment visionary. From the WCW boardroom to the WWE Hall of Fame. And his opponent, representing the NWO from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 195 pounds, Eric Bischoff! Well, guys, here's a former adversary of the WWE. A former adversary turned WWE Hall of Famer. And he still has that infamous grin. Eric Bischoff has had more than his own share of success in this business and inside the ring. Has very underrated combat skills. A black belt in karate, educated fists and feet. Now, Eric Bischoff has also managed to defeat many WCW superstars. I gotta say, the title has been looking good around this man's waist. They always ask whether the man makes the title or the title makes the man. In this case, it looks like a mutually beneficial relationship to me. We know he looks the part. Only question is whether he can be the part. This won't be a title match, but it is sure to be a difficult test for the champion. He's got a pretty unexpected foe in Eric Bischoff, but something tells me this won't be a complete walk in the park. Now, the last person who thought that paid the price for 83 weeks. Bischoff knows the business inside and out, which makes him very dangerous. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Unbelievable athleticism <laughs> into the armbar. Squirms his way out. Arm drag. Very nice. Nice leg sweep takedown. I can't believe I'm saying this, Corey, but how do you go about beating Eric Bischoff in a match? Step one is not underestimating Easy e like you have, Cole. He's got martial arts skills and the entire NWO at his beck and call. The key here is to keep the game plan simple so you don't get outsmarted and don't let up physically. Launching. Good Lord, taking flight. Just crashing down with high impact. Boom, impact. Oh, oh, oh. gosh. To the kidneys. Golly. Standing shooting star press. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Toss back into the ring. <laughs> oh man. He thinks he has it. He narrowly avoids the count. We'll see if this is the start of a rally. What great agility. Showing off the quickness, that'll turn things around in a hurry. Bischoff put a stop to that. Twist to fake. Cover. Two. Arm raised in victory, and look who's here to, to join in on the celebration. Great show of support after a hard-fought victory.
Here comes trouble in the form of damage control. You're right about that, Saxton. This is one of the most dangerous groups around. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by EO Sky, Bailey. Three women who make each other better. Multiple tag team title reigns for Dakota and Io, and countless main events for Bayley. No doubting that, but they've been taking shortcuts to get to the top of the women's division. Yeah, and here's the sad part, Michael. They don't have to take all those shortcuts. Well, you're actually right about that, Saxton. I agree, but shortcuts are what will get them to the top sooner rather than later. Quite simply, nobody can stop damage control. Here comes the Glamazon, and she is always ready for war. And their opponents first. One half of the grit couple. No fear in the eyes of Beth Phoenix. The Glamazon is a danger that most are not prepared to handle. Arguably the most physical female competitor in WWE history. The youngest Hall of Fame inductee in the history of WWE. She is a true fan favorite. From Elwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan! Guys, Liv Morgan just living out her dream here in WWE. Yeah, Liv's career has just really taken off. Became this money in the bank and then successfully cashed in the contract to become SmackDown Women's Champion. Viciousness has never looked so good. Damage control looks ready for battle. We know damage control is all about winning at all costs, doing whatever it takes to ensure the victory. So, folks, keep that in the back of your minds as this match progresses. Things could get chaotic very quickly. And Alaska's largest city certainly seems ready for this one. She catches Kai with a big counter. Ooh, she responds with a counter. Uh-oh. Russian leg sweep. Uh-oh. Good timing with that reversal. She can end it here. Kicks out at just one. Starting to see the tolls of this match add up. She's able to get the tag by the skin of her teeth. And she gets herself out of a precarious position. Vicious backdrop suplex. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. Solely focused on... Oh! Wrestling 101. If you can't stand, you can't fight. That quickly moves. Gets out of there in a hurry. Oh! A big kick to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Matt slam with some attitude. Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. She gets the tag. Let's go, let's go! Nasty. 
easy one right to the chest. Well scattered by Liv Morgan. Oh, wicked into the cover. And a kick out at two. Close call. That was almost lights out. What the heck is this manager doing looking out of the ring? She can't be acting like this. Oh, man. What a shining wizard. Ooh, what a forearm club. Neckbreaker connects. Gets the tag. Fortitude being put to the test there. Yeah, Beth just brought the fight to her. As their opponent hook hoisting them all the way up. What a fisherman suplex. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Playing possum! Whoa! She kicks out with authority. Still a ways to go in this match based on that. Running clothesline. Morgan on the receiving end. Oh my goodness. Would you look at this? She is removing the turnbuckle pad now. Ah, clubbing blow to the back. Things seem to be escalating between them. Yeah, Michael, what started as a disagreement looks like it has turned into bad blood. But here comes the fire. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Take down. Can she keep her down? Bailey is still in there. If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. She manages to get control. Oh, that's just an agitating thing to do. And Liv should have watched out for that attack. She's not smiling now. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. Well scattered reversal there. Look at this. Boom, nice. Knee drop. So she tags in. Hits the drop kick. Beth Phoenix gets tagged in. She's pumping herself. Dakota Kai. With the A couple of knees and then another one, and that'll force the break. Ooh. Ooh. And Dakota's confidence was just kept in check. Yeah, Phoenix put a little extra oomph into that one. Kick. Dakota wards off the attack. Drop kick on target. Get back here. Leg Larian. Oh, she hit the corner hard. Oh, what a forearm. Grabs their opponent by the ankle. Into a powerbomb. Oh, she counters right back on Kai. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. Jumping clothesline. What agility. These two trading counters, an absolute master class. Flips it back on her. Evil 
to reverse that one. Oh, step up in Zagari. No, oh, someone call a dentist. Measured. This could be it. Cover for the win. Breaks the count. What does she have to do to put her away? I'm asking myself the same question. I have no idea. Oh, man. Looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. So much damage inflicted. Great defense by Morgan. Looking wobbly in the corner. Uh-oh. Morgan gets intercepted. Wow, springboard attack. Tag made. Tag made. She scores big with the counter. Bailey connects with a right hand, draping her opponent between the top and middle ropes and a stunner. It's been a hard-hitting affair here tonight. These competitors are going to have trouble walking on their own after this one. Going coast to the coast. Great counter. Impressive ring IQ on display there. And responds with a counter of their own. Sidekick on point. The admiration for these superstars is echoing throughout this arena right now. Oh, that might have just broken something. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Kick! Oh, Ooh, that's a kick that would leave you gasping for air. is just ahead. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. Dominating shoulder tackle. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Well, not the hair. Anything but the hair. Just dropped her like she was nothing. Ooh. Dakota interrupts the attack. Oh! With authority! Dakota Kai with the crucifix chokehold submission. A couple of knees and then another one, and that'll force the break. Hoist it up. Tagged into action. Ooh, elbow strike. Axe kick. Liv is really out of it. She might be done soon. Dakota Kai setting up her opponent. Domination kick. Liv won't come back from that. Just in time. Dakota with plans on ending this. Oh, she counters right back on Kai. Head scissor. Here's the cover for the win. No, she kicks out. Where is she finding the strength? This is unreal. Ooh, what a four 
club. All the way up, and the big time power bomb. And now she's looking to go top rope. Perched up top. Set up for something in the corner. <laughs> what a forearm. What are they going to do here? We're about to find out. Corey, this can't be good. Backbreaker. And it's not over yet. A second time. Tagged in. Stops the kick. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. <laughs> Made her pay for her mistake. <laughs> Jumping complete shot. Face first. This looks bad for Kai. Damage control, lost control, and are leaving here defeated. With all their expertise and planning, damage control just came up short here tonight.